Hi and welcome to a little tutorial about adding online fonts to your web pages. So what I've got over here is a an HTML file and just get rid of that. Um, and a really simple little HTML file and a really simple little CSS file. And I've been a bit bad, I see. I have left a space in the file name of that. Please ignore that. Okay, so I did a little bit of looking up, and there are lots of websites you can do this at, but the one I chose was Google Fonts. It's just fonts.google.com without a www in front of it. So if it's not working for you, just check in your HTTPS colon slash slash fonts.google.com, and you get a whole heap of fonts. When you find one you like, you click on the little plus beside it. Now do I like any of these? I'll try that one. It's that big thick solid one. And I'm going to get rid of the one that I was already playing with before because that will just confuse you. Um, then once you've chosen the one you like you click on this black thing at the bottom and it pops up and you get two bits of code. One of which you copy and paste into your HTML file. I'll just get rid of what I had already pasted before because that's not what we need. Um, and you, I've been putting it up into the head of my web page. I've also got my link to my CSS file there. This is the link I just put into my font. Then down in the body of the page, I've just put I've put a div, and inside it says here is some text. And then there's some text there that's outside the div, so you can see what happens. And then in my CSS file, I'm going to add this little chunk of font of text here. And I'm going to put it into that div which is called test font and to indent it nicely. Um, so, so see how it says test font there and in my web page I'm inside that div there and all it should say is here is some text. And if I'm lucky it will say it's slightly strange looking. So we'll just save that and let's run the page. Launch in Chrome. What is it going to look like? Oh, goody. So that's the normal text. That's the fancy text. Easy peasy. Hope that helps.